and Allah promises and guarantees those eyes that cry in the middle of the night when you are talking to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He says, I'm going to protect you on a day of judgment with me. You are so special. Habibullah. The young person, only the young, not the old, the young, who always asks Allah to forgive them, is the beloved of Allah. My brothers, my sisters, Islam is a religion based on the mercy of Allah. You want evidence? When you start the Quran, what do you say? Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim, in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. If Allah wanted, He could have chosen any other names. When you start the Quran, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen, Ar Rahmanir Rahim, Subhanallah. Mercy, mercy, forgiveness, kindness. Allah is magnificent, Allah is unique, Allah is most loving, Allah is most kind, Allah is most compassionate. All of that we hear much more than anything else. Religion is based on the mercy of Allah. Yes, the punishment of Allah is the truth. But did you seek forgiveness? If the answer is yes, don't worry. Allah won't punish you. Allah is not a liar. Allah says those who repented, I don't punish them. Allah will give you and me a strength to our hearts that will be, will be able to overcome the most powerful fear and the most powerful sadness, the deepest, deepest kind of sadness. He'll make us strong enough, not that those things will go away, but you'll be strong enough to go through it. How many times my beloved brothers and sisters have negative things happened in our lives and two years later, we realize that was the most positive thing ever. Had it not been for that, I would not be where I am today. Allahu Akbar. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala releases the veil and you see Allah. Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam says, and there is nothing more beautiful, more beautiful than when they look at Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. In fact, the ulama said they will forget all the beauty in paradise that they had seen up to that point. And Allah speaks to every person in paradise. Remember this and remember that, reminiscing on this life. You say, yes, Ya Rabbi, have you not forgiven me? And Allah will say, what are you talking about? I never exposed you in that life and today I will not expose you but I just want to show you that I knew that I forgave you you see brothers and sisters we are not more merciful than Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so let's have mercy to one another don't make someone else's life difficult because Allah will make yours difficult create ease for other people help them talk to them with respect see what happens to you your family members speak properly to them. Watch your tongue. The way you talk, sometimes what you are saying is right. But the way you are saying it is so horrible. It hurts people. It offends them. They don't want to be in your company. It's very important for us to get to know one another for the right reasons. I love you. Not because I want something from you or because you're an important person. Simply because Allah has instructed me to love you. I love you for the sake of Allah. The pleasure of Allah. If I see you in pain, I'm in pain. If I see you happy, I share the joy. If I see you sad, I'd like to help. If I see anything coming in your direction that is negative, I'd like to do something about it.